Money management in betting on sports. When betting on sports, it's no surprise for you to know that hundreds of bettors lose their bets. Well, losing at sports, betting is just normal. But you didn't wonder why so many people lose at betting on sports despite the fact that sports betting provides them with better chances to winning? Some say it's because of poor handicapping. But while this can be true, for me it's not just the exact reason that bettors lose their... as there are hundreds of folks that are experienced in handicappers who still lose their shirts year in and year out. The truth of the matter is, people lose betting on sports because of poor money management skills. People with poor money management skills are usually uninformed. However, this is not often the case with other managers their money poorly because they are undisciplined. No matter what the case may be, people who lose at betting on sports are both uninformed and undisciplined. So if you are serious about success in betting on sports, then I guess it's very crucial for you to make plans and remain disciplined. As what most of the money management experts say, often say, it's best to set you up with your own goals, your strategy for winning, and betting on sports. And of course, some betting rules that will always keep in mind during your sports betting. When I say setting up your goals, what I mean is think first from what you want from certain sports books. Should you set up your goals as money, limit that you want to earn. Always remember that when betting on sports, one should only bet money that he or she can't afford to lose. To put it simply, never bet with money that you cannot afford to lose or you do not have for that certainly only bring lots of problems in the end. As soon as you have the setup for betting goals, you should then start defining betting st strategies that m you might take. One particular winning strategy that I am familiar about is the so-called betting on singles only. According to some expert bettors and handicappers, it's very important that when betting on sports you avoid accumulators. Perhaps one main support of this fact is that you possibly your possibilities for winning at sports betting are decreased with every game added to the accumulator. So at the beginning of the game or betting season, try to set your u usual betting amount and only be bet most of your singles. Then when you find yourself winning at particular betting season, do not increase your stakes. This is also true when either you are losing in a losing streak. Finally, betting on sports is a time for a little rest. So if you find yourself losing streak when betting on sports, it seems that you may cannot win. Think that maybe it's time for you to take a little rest. Consider it not to bet for a week or two. As far as I know, this will help you obtain a better view of things. Also, think in sports betting, not at all seasons are your favor. You should know that most punters increase their bets every time they lose a couple of bets because they think that they can't miss all the time. The truth of the matter is, is that it is not a truth for all time. The point is, don't be greedy.